Hey guys, Rook Knight here. Thanks for joining me. Uh, today I wanted to talk about the South Ord uh, Jackknife, the uh, JPXS6. This isn't a review. Um, I actually just wanted to show you a hack on this or whatever you want to call it. So when you have this jackknife, it's a great knife. It's, it's awesome. I love it. I got it when they had a deal going. I got it pretty decent price. I was really happy about that. Um, every time I watch a review on these, I always see a complaint. And the number one complaint is when you open this up and you tighten it because of this little rubber gasket they have here it makes this loose this kind of wiggles and, and jiggles and you go to tighten it and and your pick is still wiggly some more than others actually so i've seen ones where like they were like this even though they were had them tightly down my trick that i've been using and i've been trying to do it for about a week now or more actually and it works fantastic it keeps the uh it keeps this uh, in check and doesn't have it move, and it also keeps us from unscrewing and the whole nine yards, and it also is a tight uh, fit. And if I can get this little O-ring off, I will show you. What I did is I took a pen and found a pen. This one is a Pilot G2 at 07, and I got out, well, see if we can get something to get this out. Bear with me for one second. I thought I had it figured out. I got the spring out. And what I basically did was I cut a small little piece, about like uh, two or three, you know, turns. Um, not the chunk part. You got to take that first initial part off and then count about two or three. You can see here, I actually lined it up. So I did one, two, three, and I cut there and cut there. Now you put that onto your screw and it's actually a really great fit believe it or not so that's why you got to get the pilot pens because they fit the best and then when you go to screw it in not only does it hold that very tightly so it doesn't come unscrewed but this becomes rock hard nice and strong so you still can unscrew it and you still even have a little tension on your uh, spring to be able to turn it but then once you go and tighten it up again you got a good long nice strong sturdy uh, picking so you're not having that because that's what was happening with that o-ring i mean i you'd be picking and it'd be like this that that's useless i'm sorry i mean it's a beautiful tool and they kind of mess it up with that o-ring but like i said all you do is you find a pen you can find two of these probably at the dollar store if you're looking around hard enough but a Pilot G2 might be even a couple of dollars in the grocery store. These springs are perfect. And you could, and if you have more than one, you could probably even get more than one. Because I got this cheap bang good one or whatever. Um, and I did the same thing to it. And that's how I did it to make sure it was tension. Because this didn't come with anything. And this worked great. It tightened it. It tightened the bolt. And it also tightened the head or the profile. So like I said, uh, if anybody's out there looking for a fix other than this... Uh, little bat black gasket that they have they were charging like a dollar fifty for if you lose it too and honestly it's it's not any good it doesn't work it it keeps it too much loose like this you know what i mean you can't be picking like that so just by taking and you know cutting a couple rings off and that gives you significant uh tension pulling pushing back so it doesn't loosen up on you and you actually have to you could feel a difference and um I don't know. I hope that helps somebody out there. And these things are awesome. I really enjoy having them. I, I carry this one around with me and uh, just the in case kind of thing. I don't really use it too much for um, everyday picking because I have other picks, you know. But this definitely is a fine tool. And like I said, this little hack will definitely help you um, with tightening up those heads, those profiles. So any profile that you're using, that rubber gasket was making that too much of a wiggle. And with just a little bit of tightness, look at that. That thing, that's sturdy. That ain't going nowhere. You know what I mean? And it's still providing that little bit of back tension on there so it doesn't come unscrewed. Um, I don't know. I've, I've been trying it out for two weeks. Testing it on and off works fantastic. Hope it helps.